getting your own music performed is it's quite hard to compare it to something else because you are sitting in your room <laughs> you're sitting at the computer and you're writing like your music but it's only you who hears it and then once you get into the room it's not yours only anymore like someone is interpreting it someone is listening to it and uh, it gives it a whole like several more dimensions but it is very gratifying What I like about RNCM is like it has a very international kind of environment and everyone is so lovely here and uh, the building is open, uh, it's very welcoming and accommodating to, to students here. It's a real place to, that you can kind of hang out in as well as study. Uh, it's always good to meet people at the end of a busy day for a drink in the bar and just to kind of relax and chill out after what could have been quite a stressful day. We have one-on-one -on -one lessons with our tutors and then we just have free time where we are free to just write, which every composer needs. Um, I think one of the best things about our course is just the freedom to be able to work with different instrumentalists. So everything that you write is able to be played around college. And we have, um, as it were, the composition equivalent of performance classes are we, the, what we call composer labs, where any composer can bring in a sketch of a piece, half a piece, a full piece, a few bars, to a session where we have players that will play back the music and will work on the music in that session and that all of that gets recorded. I've had pieces played on Radio 3 after, like since coming here, which I mean I definitely wouldn't have had opportunities like that if I'd gone elsewhere. Just recently I got a piece shortlisted uh, in the competition for performance opportunity with the BBC Phil this November and I think it's a very exciting um, occasion. In the first year we did a collaboration with the Royal Northern Ballet and then this year we had to write a composition for moving picture with one film team at MMU just next door. But then also uh, um, I got in touch with a video game development team. They're all studying at University of Salford, which is just the next place. Last March I had the opportunity to have my choral piece workshopped by, by the BBC singers led by Judith Weir. It was good just to have such a well-known group be able to sing your piece and to have a recording that is so good. Not only do you have these fantastic opportunities to get your pieces performed and to study with um, amazing tutors, but also you can, especially when you're in your first year and you're living in halls, which is just over the road, um, you can just step over and come and see some like amazing music. I find that I collaborate with loads of people in the city as well as in college. So I work with visual artists and filmmakers and dancers who are all like based in Manchester. In terms of promoting your own music, this is quite a strong place. They teach you how to do, how to network properly, how to work on your website, how to work on your stage presence and all these kind of things play a major role in a world that is um, about the all-round musician. It's not only about the music, but then it is all about the music. I think that's a unique selling point that we can offer performance by large ensemble, particularly orchestra. That's something that I know when I was a student, it, it didn't happen and, I, and it was like an incredible sort of um, an incredible pipe dream to be able to think, wow, wouldn't it be wonderful to write for an orchestra one day? And um, students here can do that now. Whether if you're a performer, you have opportunities to perform in some of the biggest performance venues in the UK. And as a composer, we have opportunities to work with professional ensembles and orchestras that you, you wouldn't get studying in other places.